ninataka kuwaomba wa Kenya wasiende barabarani waende kazini kwao hakuna kipato tutapata barabarani na barabarani ndio nafasi ya huliganism ya looting ya violence na kama tunajua mahali watu waliuawa ni barabarani kwenye maandamano manake yule mwenye kuita maandamano hata kuwa na, mam, na uwezo wa kucontrol crowds zinazowafuata wa Kenya ni watulivu mpaka watakapochochewa na mimi nasema hivi kibinafsi kama maandamano yanafanywa wiki hii yana ma, ma, yana nia mbaya na kwa ajili hiyo sisi kanisa tunakataa tunasema watu waende biasharani watu waende kazini wafanye kazi zao walioshindwa walishindwa walioshinda walishinda na sasa tujengeni taifa letu tunasema maandamano hayo yasifanywe maana amekusudi makusudi yake si mazuri tuache mahakama ya upeo itoe maamuzi yake tuache rais atakayetangazwa atangazwe aapishwe atawale Kenya ni yetu sote na yule atakayetangazwa Hakuna haja ya kuleta fujo. Tumekuwa na utulivu. My name is Collins Modime. I'm a resident here in Malindi and as a Christian, I like to take the opportunity to say congratulations to all Kenyans for observing peace and also to the Right Honorable Odinga and the Azimio party for seeing the way forward is to go to the court. And now that the matter is on the Supreme Court, I pray that um, the judgment to uh, the jurisprudence of the law and the wisdom given by god they'll give the right verdict and after the verdict i'll also ask um, we all kenyans to observe peace because uh, it's within peace even the bible says it's when there's peace and love within brothers and sisters that blessings can be poured upon us god bless you all and congratulations kenyans for keeping peace i'll pray that people will maintain peace and we'll seek God more because whatever we have gained this time as Kenyans, it is all God's doing. So we should learn to respect what God has said and we should learn to respect the people God that has chosen. Let us maintain peace and let us trust God for better tomorrow.